There were more than a few young ladies who tried to capture his attention, some who even tried to bribe me with gifts, but none of them ever came close to being good enough for my best friend, Big Brother. When I met Carolyn in 2015, it was quite evident that she was also a special soul. She radiated with compassion and strength and wisdom and kindness. She offered me no bribes, just her friendship with no hesitation, as she does with everyone she encounters. We hadn't known each other for very long, aka a few hours, when I told her she and Sam may be a good match. <laughs> when they finally met and the sparks flew, I was overjoyed to know that my best friend, Big Brother, would be loved by such a high caliber woman for the rest of his life. And as soon as we met Carolyn, we knew that she was very special, very unique, very wonderful person, and we wanted her in our lives. So we were walking out of the restaurant, Carolyn was with me, and she said, oh wait, I need to go back and say goodbye to Sam. And I'm like, I hope it's more like Ella. And we were so excited that they started dating the next day. Carolyn and I did lose our parents in 2014 and in 2015. You know, a lot of people that will tear your family apart sometimes, but instead it really glued ours together. Night wouldn't be complete without talking about Bev and Susan. Y'all might not remember me at the, end of, at the end of this, but I promise you if Bev was here tonight, everybody at this wedding would have left and they'd been like, Carolyn's dad, Bev, I mean, good <laughs> God. I mean, it is, you would have known Bev. You know, they're dearly missed. They certainly are, and, and you know, they're gonna be with us tomorrow. Carolyn, you're so special. You have so much grace. Um, I see your mom and you so much, and the way you own a crowd, and the way you treat people. You always wanna know everybody's name. You make everybody feel like they're mo the most important person in the room. My first couple thoughts were, wow, she's nice. <laughs> Good job, Sammy. <laughs> and then the second thing I thought was she's very graceful. Carol is the most wonderful person and the kindest and sweetest person I know. And Sam, you are. Y'all are like a match made in heaven. And when I think about y'all, I, I think God brought together the two most precious people. The two of you together are going to be something extremely special. I know that you are going to have an amazing marriage because you and Sam have worked so hard to get to know each other and to do hard things together and to go into this with your eyes wide open and your hearts full of love for each other. Carolyn, you're so beautiful, funny, and caring. And Sam, you're smart, thoughtful, and loyal. And you two are going to have an amazing life together. It's just all been the perfect timing. And it's the perfect place, it's the perfect group of people, it's the perfect moment for you guys. Bev actually, uh, uh, he walked me down the aisle, or not walked me down the aisle. <laughs> <laughs> he, he walked my wife down the aisle. And so he gave Barbara away 18 years ago, and I have the pleasure of walking Carolyn down the aisle tomorrow. Into this holy union, Samuel Cornett and Carolyn Howard now come to be joined. Sam, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> <laughs>